guys, um, we are ready to get started. Um, so my name is Sarah. I am a customer success manager here at Company Cam. Uh, we've got a whole team with us here today from the support team to um, enterprise customer success to marketing. Um, and we're excited to talk to you about our new AI features. Um, so a quick, uh, a, a few quick things here. Um, this is being recorded. So if you want to watch it later or you need to share it with your team, it will be in your inbox within 24 hours. So you will get a recording of this class. Um, if you have questions along the way, if you will please just put them in the Q&A box located at the bottom of the screen, that would be great. Um, we're going to leave the chat open for us to share things. So Q&A box is perfect for your questions, um, and we will do our best. We've got our team here to answer those for you. So um, I believe we should go ahead and we should get started here. If If you need anything else, just let us know. But um, we're going to start off with a video here. So again, we're talking about our AI features, a few other functionality features as well. Um, but our CEO and founder, Luke, really says it best when it comes to some of these new features. So we have a pretty cool video here that I'm going to start off with. Um, and then we're going to go ahead and get into our agenda and start going through these features. All right, I've been wanting this for a long time and we finally have it. I mean, I'm talking since before we started Company Cam, like 10 years ago, I wanted to take pictures, talk to my phone. This is the living room. It looks like they have the window headers framed in. And that's it. No notebook, no pushing buttons in some form app, no filling out a worksheet. And then it makes this for you. You get this document. I didn't make this. It just made it automatically. It used AI, what I was saying, to organize everything, to simplify it, to put the pictures in there. You can share, you can edit, you can drag the photos around. It's so freaking cool. And this is just the beginning. This is just the beginning. All right, I've been wanting this for a long time. Okay. Alrighty, so as Luke said, this is really just the beginning of our AI features here. Um, so I'm gonna talk to you guys about what is the AI trial, give you an overview of that. Um, talk about our quick caption, uh, that functionality that lives within your camera that allows you to add descriptions um, to your photos, again, directly from your camera. Um, we're gonna talk about pages. These are great for your daily logs, your material list. Um, this lives under the pages tab within company cam. Our AI note, that's what you were just seeing there in the video. So allowing AI to be your digital assistant and help you build out what you're seeing to go hands-free. And all you have to do is snap the video, snap the photos and think out loud. Um, and then to wrap up the day, I'm actually going to do a quick sneak peek of a feature that we are demoing really for the first time called our progress report. Um, so and that involves our AI as well. So um, to do a quick little overview of what is our AI trial, this really is just a limited time for you guys to test out our AI features. So um, if you guys are following along in the app today, you should see that you have access to it. Um, again, this is going to be called the AI note. You should have access to this. Um, if you don't, it's just possible you just need to update your app. Um, so you can simply do that by pushing through an update or just um, uninstall and reinstall the app will always push through a new update. So again, the AI trial is a limited time offer um, before it goes to premium here in late September. And so pro users, you have access to this right now. And of course, our premium users as well. All righty. So we're going to go ahead and get started here. Um, we're going to start off with our quick caption. Um, and I'm just going to, let's see here. Alrighty, our quick caption, this is gonna live primarily on the mobile side. So this is gonna be um, the feature that pops up to allow you to leave a quick description um, while you are in the camera. So my first step here, I'm on the left-hand side, primarily on my mobile device, logged into company cam. Um, I'm gonna go into my bathroom remodel project here. And so quick caption lives in the camera. So I'm just gonna scroll down to the bottom here where I see my camera. And I'm going to just start snapping some photos. So when I'm in my camera feature here, you'll see that gray bar that pops up that says description with a microphone. It's prompting you to leave that description. So I'm going to take another photo here. I'm going to click this and say, we need to replace this sheet. Hit done. Maybe I'll move over to the other one. Hit description. We need to paint the walls blue instead of gray. 
hit done, move on, do one more here. We need to replace the table, hit done. Okay, so all I was doing was just with my finger clicking that microphone, so it started listening to me, where then again, it leaves that description directly on the photo. Um, so on the left-hand side here, you guys can quickly get to your camera tray, um, just like normal, where you can see those photos that I just took, those five in that sequence. And the ones that I turned on quick caption for, or I hit description, are going to have the icon with the three bars in the bottom right corner. So I know I did leave a description with that photo. So I can click on it here and I can see we need to replace this sheet. So I can open that up. If you want to add more context, you can um, just simply hit that edit button and you can have access to your keyboard. Otherwise, um, again, you can even speak longer while you're doing your quick caption. I made that pretty short. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and hit save. Um, and again, it really stays out of the way for you. So if you just want to continue to snap photos and not use it, it's just going to slide down for you. So um, the whole point of this is just to make your life easier. Um, really it, avoid errors or any sort of typos that you might have while you're out in the field. Um, turn on that speech to text and then you will be good to go. Okay, we're going to move on here. Um, so we're going to talk about our pages feature. And so this is really like your customizable digital notepad. Um, so again, this is primarily used for your material list, your daily log. Um, you guys can customize this to how you would like it to look once you've created that page. So um, you can do this both mobile and desktop. So I'll show you both. Um, I'm in my, my bathroom remodel project still. Um, and you'll see that we have this pages tab right here on the mobile side. It's going to be located right next to your tasks. So I'm going to go ahead, click on pages. Um, if you hit this plus button, create page. And then also on the mobile side here, um, I'm going to hit the plus button for page. And located down at the bottom is where we want to look, where it says start with an example. Um, on the right hand side here, we have the same thing, start with an example. Um, so I'm going to just click on one here. Let's maybe do our materials list. Um, so you'll see it kind of already has a structure built out for you here where you can pop in here. I'm just going to simply just click on the screen next to length and I'm going to add in, you know, my, my information here. And then I can scroll down and I can put in, you know, what I need to right here next to the size, so on and so forth. Um, we give you quite a few different options as far as customizing this. So you'll see you have access to your camera. So you can simply snap a photo and pop it in there if you would like. Um, next to that, we have the photo with the plus button. So that's just prompting you to access your, pro your, your project photos. So maybe I'm going to go back from February here. I'm going to select that one, add it in. Um, so... Again, just a quick way to get your notes out there. Um, this is gonna live on every single project for you. Again, this is called Pages. Um, I'm gonna hit that plus button one more time to show you some more examples. Um, we do give you a blank page, so start from scratch. Um, the materials list, we were just in that one. We also have a daily log, work order, and then we also have estimate. So again, um, I highly recommend guys just pop it into your company cam account and going to your pages tab, start messing around with this, how it can work for you, see what you like, um, test it out, give us feedback. We would love that. Um, but you all should have access to this within your account right now. Um, last but not least, uh, the question always comes up of like, how do I share this? And so we've made it really easy for you. We have this share button in the top right corner on desktop. And then also on mobile, you have this handy little arrow. Uh, so if you click on that, um, it's just going to generate that link for you. We do that often within company cam with our galleries, reports, things like that, where you can simply text it out, send it to the email or send it out via email, um, or just simply leave it in company cam, um, helps the next people come into the job site to see, you know, what's in here. Okay. Um, we're going to move over into our AI notes. So what you saw in the video with Luke, um, this is the exciting time. This is kind of where we get into that AI trial period. Um, so this is going to be on the mobile side here. Um, I'm going to stay in my pages tab. Um, I'm going to go back to that plus button by page. So the, almost the exact same spot where we were. Um, and you will see the first option here that says AI note. Um, talk, capture, and get organized with your notes. So 
this AI note just allows you to go hands-free. Um, all you need to do is speak out loud and then of course snap the photos that you would like as you're walking around the job site. Um, you will see once I um, turn this on and get going with the AI note that you can say lots of different words. Like I think somebody said 10,000 words on a job site or something, and it will take it and put it into a nice bulleted list for you um, and cut out the fluff. So the ums or if somebody else is talking to you, it's just going to, it's going to put it into a nice looking AI note for you, where you can then keep it for internal purposes, or you can share it out with your customer. Um, one example, I was just talking with a roofer the other day. He uses this when, right when he gets to the job site or his sales team. Um, so when they walk the property, they're turning on that AI note and then they're able to capture everything and just think out loud. So um, I'll show you how it works. So again, on the mobile side, under pages, um, we're gonna hit create with AI. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start this. It's gonna give you a countdown here. So I'm gonna say, this is Sarah Matern's project here at Company Cam headquarters. We're in the studio and um, this table needs to be replaced. And then up here over on the door, that also needs to probably have a bit of an upgrade. The handle isn't looking too nice. Um, up here in the ceiling, maybe we should paint that blue. And um, let's see here, maybe the carpet should get cleaned. And let's pick up the tape that is also on the carpet. I'm gonna hit that pause button. So this little red button here in the bottom right corner, you can pause if you know I am talking to somebody else or the customer comes up to me and I can just simply unpause and get going again and say, let's replace those outlets over there. Okay, so um, you guys get the point here. I just hit done and what it's, it says that it's pending here of that AI note. Um, you can keep going, of course, and just be thinking out loud what you're seeing. One thing I will point out, I was taking the photos. Um, so that is a common question. So I was saying this table needs to replace and need to be replaced. And then I was just taking a photo like normal um, as I was speaking out loud. So um, it looks like it's already processed here. So I'm gonna go ahead and click on that page. I'm gonna show you on desktop as well. Um, and so here it's, I said, this is Sarah's project and I talked about office upgrades. So it does give you that default like um, AI note title there. You guys can of course go in and customize this as you would like. Um, but we talked about studio upgrades, um, replace the table, upgrade the door handle, um, carpet maintenance outlet replacement. So um, we just really kind of section that out for you nicely. But again, if I wanted to add more, I can just simply click into that page um, I'm going to enter down and say um, new covers to be ordered. So you guys can go in and do what you would like and what you need to upgrade or, or change in here. So you'll see you do have access to that camera again if you'd like to add in more photos or if you want to add some from the project. I can go in and, you know, maybe add in another one there. So um, yeah, that's our AI note. Um, you'll see we also have it here on the desktop side. Um, you are able to make those edits as well. Um, and we both have that share button. So if you want to send this out right away um, or, or just leave it for internal purposes, again, that's great. But hit that arrow. Um, it's going to generate that link for you where you can text to email it out. Very similar um, to our pages there. But of course, you can get it out of your company cam. Uh, one other thing I'll point out here, um, and these three dot these three dots in the top right corner here, if you click on that, you can hit view transcript. So if you do want to read what you were saying, you do have the ability there. Uh, we do give you that option. So you can view that transcript um, just to make sure if that is good for you. Um, and then, of course, under those three dots, you can always delete it if you need. Okay. Um, any questions so far? We've had this question a few times um, around language with AI. Mm. Um, can you specify if it only translates English right now? Um, or is there any sort of way that it can yeah. interpret it to another language? Um, Great question. You, yeah, just some point of I mean, I'm going to, I honestly haven't had this question before. I am assuming it's English, but I could be, okay. It is just going to be for English now. I, that is re really a great question and something we can pass to our product team here. I know we have them on this Zoom as well. So um, definitely fantastic. And we'll put it on our radar.
Okay, already. Um, last thing I'm going to show you here, this is going to be the sneak peek of our progress reports. So we actually, this isn't live yet, um, really our first time demoing it on a class and for most customers. So um, really exciting stuff here. So our progress report, um, it also plays in with our quick caption. So that was the first thing I demoed of when you're in the camera, they're speaking out loud and it's putting that description with the photo. Um, so taking those descriptions and putting it into like a quick summarized note for you to send out the door. So I'll show you what I mean. It is different than our AI note. Um, I'm going to be still in that pages tab here um, in my mobile app. I'm going to hit that plus button next to page. So same sort of progress here. Um, and then I'm going to hit progress report. So um, it then takes you to your project photos. Um, I'm going to scroll down here to February because I have a lot of different descriptions going on here. This was a real project that we have. Um, I'm just going to select all of them next to the 27th here. I want to send all of these out to my manager. And we're also going to do the ones from January. So um, you can also individually select them just kind of like if you're sharing a gallery link. I'm going to select those photos. And then I'm going to hit generate in the bottom right corner. It says it's collecting all those photos and all of those descriptions, and it's summarizing it with AI and generating this page for us. I think so. My phone is running a little slow today, maybe. There we go. Okay. Oh, didn't like that. Let's try it one more time. You know, I, I literally tried this like 20 times before our class. So um, it's probably just me and my phone being in the studio here. But um, as this generates here, and maybe we'll try another project. Again, what it's doing is it's taking those descriptions from the photo and it's putting it into a nice summarized report for you. So at the top, it's going to have a summary. Actually, let me just show you one here. Oh, that's not it. Okay. So my phone's having a hard time today. I have the iPhone mini. Don't ever buy an iPhone mini. <laughs> there we go. Okay. <laughs> Um, we've got it. So I also pulled the one that I was testing out earlier this morning. So what it did is I hit create progress report. I selected those photos and here's what we have. So project name, project address going to be up at the top. It's two of the most important things. Um, we also have the summary date and then the taker. So my teammate, Nick was actually, this is his real bathroom, which is so cool. Um, so it gives you a quick summary here of what is going on. Um, again, it's pulling the summary from the descriptions in the photos. Um, so you guys can see that here. Um, it's a bathroom renovation in progress with the installation of the door handle, so on and so forth. I don't need to read that for you. You guys can all see that. Um, and so I'm going to scroll down here and it's going to say completed installations. So the door handle installed and removed brown tile and replaced with white. That is the description on the photo. So I actually, we, we use quick caption for that or we, we typed it in there, I guess, I'm not sure. Um, and it pulled that into the progress report. So um, it will pull in all of those descriptions, which is great, right under the photos, plus an additional nice little summary here, um, pulling again from those descriptions. So I hope that wasn't too confusing. I know I was kind of all over the place with that, but again, it's gonna be under your pages tab. Um, when this goes live, this is a sneak peek. Um, we're going to hit that plus button and then it'll be under progress report. So get using the quick captions or start utilizing descriptions within company cam because we're building a lot of tools that are going to make it easier for you to just streamline that, get it into the report or into that note so you can send it out the door um, to your boss or to a customer, whoever needs to see those um, progress reports. So um, just like everything else, you can share this out. You've got that share button in the top right corner, um, very similar to our other pages.